Between July 1st and July 4th, in 1776 and again in 1883, monumental events happened in America. Today we focus in on the 4th of July. Even though the delegates to the Continental Congress in Philadelphia had already voted for the Declaration of Independence days before, it was on the 4th that the document was announced and read and the celebrations began. John Adams had predicted that in every year to come in the new country, from one coast to the other, there would be big celebrations, but he could never have imagined the way Americans would commemorate the events. But as the Civil War lingered on in 1883, July 4th would be a special day at Gettysburg. The courageous men under Robert E. Lee made a slow retreat back into Virginia after nearly winning in three days of horrific fighting. But it was a Union victory, and some say a turning point in the war. But something else happened that same day a thousand miles to the southwest. General Grant, after 10 months of isolation and bombardment, took Vicksburg. That gave the Union control of the Mississippi, and it happened on the 4th of July. Happy 4th, I'm Dennis Daly.